welcome to Woodset Central. I thought it was about time that I gave you an update on the work I've been doing on the scenery. Uh, the track laying to the extension is now finished of course, as you will have seen in my previous videos. So the job now is to start the work on the scenery. Uh, I haven't done a lot of scenery to date so uh, there's plenty to go at. The first job that I wanted to undertake was raising the station level so that the new track layout, which is a through track through the station, uh, can be made to work properly. And this is basically what I'll be showing you this afternoon, the progress on this part of the scenery. Okay then, let's start and have a look at what I've been doing. Okay, this is the view looking down the length of the platforms. Zoom in. You can see that towards the end of the platforms I've now raised the station. Uh, it's still missing some steps and there are a couple of tunnels that accommodate the track that goes out through to the extension to the layout and also into the extended fiddle yard. Taking a look at the station now, I propose having two sets of steps coming down onto the platforms here. These five tracks, one, two, three, four and five, all join together under the bridge structure into the main up and down line. So the station can be served in any one of the four the four platforms, one, two, three and four and there's a passing loop where the train is currently parked as you can see. Moving on to the high level area I haven't quite decided how I'm going to use this. My current thoughts are towards having a shopping area um, with shops and a bank, perhaps a cinema surrounding the station area and to have a station car park. At the moment I've got a, a garage and a couple of industrial units but they're only of a temporary nature just to give some depth to the scenery. The high level area is served by a ramp and I'm currently thinking of curving the road round and bringing a road down in front of the ramp and in front of what will be some sloping terrain. The embankment will be covered with plaster cloth and finished with grass that's suitable for the area using the method that uh, Mr. Howarth uses. I think he uses cornflakes boxes. Uh, we don't have cornflakes so uh, mine are alpine boxes but uh, there we go same effect. So the next job is to add some plaster cloth to uh, the embankment there and start adding some static grass. It will be my first experiment with static grass. I just bought myself an applicator to uh, have a go at it. The other thing I need to do is finalize the layout of the high level area behind the station and lay some uh, road accordingly but I probably leave that until I've decided on what buildings I'll have in the area. Anyway that's just a quick update on what I've been doing. I'll keep you informed as I've made more progress so just like to thank you for watching and if you haven't subscribed be very pleased if you would and uh, perhaps leave me some comments or suggestions on what I might do next. Bye for now.